I just feel really lucky to get to work with nature and to work with these really exciting species and bring them to life as art pieces. For me, the most exciting part about the project is I get to combine both um, my creative practice and, and working with nature, um, particularly working in areas of conservation. I think it's more just to have it clear... Knowing that we're going to be cladding them with something um, more artistically driven, so we're not going to get that realistic texture, but therefore the colour and the paint effect has to be completely perfect so that you understand which species you're, you're looking at. Taking a species and bringing it to life in its kind of, in its natural image, but as an, as an artistic creation is, is really important for me. Detail, like he's gotten the colours and, and stuff the fading, like that. Though, Gail. I know, isn't it amazing? One, two. The cuckoo is a pretty bird. She's dum 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 to make her voice so dum 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 da da. Nature and music is an interesting collaboration. When we think about instruments, a lot of those are made from natural items. And as a singer, I'd like to think that the echoes of our voices, that's probably where singing maybe started from, people being in the cave and hearing how their voice sounded and they're like, wow. She flies amongst white flowers to make her voice all so clear. And when we hear her singing, the summer draweth me. Our world is so precious. Nobody wants to live in a place where it's all a concrete city. We want to hear birds. That makes our lives, those are the stuff that makes our lives richer. The winter she dislikes, she shuns her rain and snow. With her I will be singing, and off with her I go.